What's going on, y'all? Holy shit here. In this video, we're going to see what the Greek god Oceanus can do on defense. So if anybody can guess what that other clip was from, be the first to comment. Anyway, he is limit broken. He is a paladin. All right. Check the box there. I like that. Uh, average amount of speed at 1044 attacks. So they must have went the attack path there because that's seriously high stats. Uh, defense is 884, 1594 HP. That's a little bit too low for an average amount of speed hero. So on offense, that's a really good path. On defense, that might not be the best path. So depending on how you're going to use them, obviously you're going to use them you know, both ways, at least offensively. So if you really wanted to do something defensively, make sure you hit that uh, you know, defense path. Anyway strength of the behemoth is his ability which deals 220 percent damage to all enemies all right i like that i like any hero that attacks all enemies all allies get plus 120 percent normal attack for four turns this effect can be active in addition to effects that alter attack in general normal attacks can have a total max of 170 percent increased power while this effect is active so that's kind of sounds like the ice hero mickey where you know, a lot of people like using Mickey for, like, Titans and stuff like that. Uh, on your defense setup, usually not the hero to use, especially with slow amount of speed. So he already has the edge on that character, which at average amount of speed compared to slow amount of speed. Can't go wrong with that. On top of that, he is giving all of his allies plus 46% defense for four turns. So that is... He's offensive, he's defensive, he attacks, he can help every single one of your heroes if he goes off. I mean, he you're getting a lot of bang for your buck here. Uh, you know, it's really the only turnoff is uh, his stats are just a smidge low for average amount of speed. And he is part of the Atlantis family. So with that family, you can end up bumping up his defense because if you have up to five heroes of the same family, you can get up to 25%. Additional defense so that could really mitigate the issue with the 884 low defense so couple that with the paladin i mean he could end up being pretty damn tanky if uh, you have him you know set up right so i really like that bonus kind of reminds me of like 2018 hero of the month fan bonus uh, that's only up to 20 percent but you need five heroes to get the 25 percent with the 2018 fan bonus you only need three so, um, his attack is pretty good. Um, it looks like he had, let's see, attack of 558, 497, 496, 478, 609. So, I would just call it a bar, ballpark of uh, just over 500 attack. So, that's, you know, 2,500 uh, damage. So, that's pretty good. So, let's just say with this uh, setup, I already obliterated him. So, I'm going to go into a uh, small detail of what happened there and why this dude is awesome. So, uh, essentially, I used Loki to uh, use his ability against, uh, you know, and that's one thing is you know, having Loki, you can just use everybody's ability and test it out and see if you like it or not. So, used his ability, uh, had the attack up. Now, keep in mind, it doesn't uh, affect your offens offensive special skills, but it does affect your tile damage. So, just to keep in mind, uh, he had his Paladin defense up. He had his plus 46 defense up. Uh, and I hit him with three tiles. I had no idea I was going to obliterate him. Those three tiles, even without the defense up, was 16, 618, 610, and 588 attack on that dude. Now, although he is of the opposite element, you know, ice is uh, strong against him. That was serious stats for somebody who had all that uh, defense up. So I'm just going to say that, you know, defensively, you know, he's a, he's a little bit lagging there. Uh, with the right synergy, he could be anywhere up to an A minus. But on this setup, you know, I'll give him a solid B plus. Uh, offensively, he definitely gets an A plus all day. I like everything about this dude. So let me know what y'all think. I'll catch you on the next one. And later, y'all.